Welcome to The Real Deal, and today we're gonna cover four ways homeowners can use their equity. Your equity is a powerful tool that can help you achieve your goals as a homeowner. And chances are, your equity grew substantially over the past year. According to the latest Equity Insights report from CoreLogic, homeowners gained an average of $51,500 in equity over the past year. If you're looking for the best ways to use your growing equity, here are four options. One, use your equity to buy a home that fits your needs. If you're finding you no longer have the space you need, it might be time to move into a larger home. Or if it's possible, you have too much space and you would like something smaller. No matter the situation, consider using your equity to power a move into a home that fits your changing lifestyle. Moving into a larger home can provide extra space for remote work or loved ones. Downsizing, on the other hand, may mean saving time and money by caring for a smaller home. Number two, move to the location of your dreams. If the size of your home isn't a challenge, but your current location is, it could be time to relocate to a new area. Maybe you enjoy vacationing in the mountains, at the beach, or another area, and you're just dreaming of living there year round. Or perhaps the distance between you and your loved ones is greater than you'd like and you need to close the gap. No matter what, your equity can fuel your move to the location where you really wanna live. Number three, start a new business. If you're not ready to move into a new home, you can use your equity to invest in a new business venture. As the US Small Business Administration Office Advocacy says, quote, there is an estimate of 31.7 million small business owners in the United States. Many of them started their businesses with the equity they had in their home. While it's not recommended that homeowners use their equity for unnecessary spending, leveraging your equity to start a business that you're passionate about can potentially grow your nest egg further. Number four, fund and education. Whether you have a loved one preparing to head off to college or you're planning to go back to school yourself, the thought of paying for higher education can be daunting. In either situation, using a portion of your growing equity can help you with those costs so you can make an investment in someone's future. Here's the bottom line, ladies and gents. Your equity can help you achieve your goals. If you're unsure of how much equity you have in your home, Let's connect today so we can start planning your next move. That's all we've got time for today on this episode. So as always, please don't hesitate to like, share and subscribe. It would mean the world to me. And also when I see a like and these subscriptions coming in, it tells me I'm on the right track with my content. So again, very appreciated and we'll see you next week.